Hey, Psych2Goers. Thank you so much for all your love and support. Psych2Go aims to help everyone learn more about psychology in a fun and digestible way. Let's begin. Did you know your subconscious mind is thousands of times stronger than your conscious mind? The subconscious mind handles over 95% of your brain's activity. Nearly everything you do is controlled, organized, or influenced by your subconscious mind. But how powerful is your subconscious? Researchers are only beginning to unlock the secrets of the subconscious. In this video, we're going to reveal six of the most mysterious facts about your subconscious mind. 1. It controls your behavior. Your subconscious controls all kinds of involuntary functions. From breathing, to heart rate, to digestion, your body would spiral out of control without your subconscious mind. Most people think the subconscious mind stops there. It seems like everything above the surface is controlled by your conscious brain. But the subconscious plays a much larger role than you think. Try to remember the last time you got scared. Did you scream? Did you jump or run away? In those moments, the subconscious mind takes over movement, emotion, and speech. When a scary figure pops up out of the shadows, you don't stop to think. Your body reacts almost instantly. Why? Because your subconscious has taken control, and it stays in control until the danger has passed. 2. It attacks your body. The conscious and subconscious parts of your brain communicate regularly, but sometimes your conscious mind stops listening. When that happens, your subconscious will do anything to be heard. Let's say, deep down, you're feeling tense and anxious. If your conscious mind is ignoring those negative feelings, your subconscious may communicate stress by attacking your body. According to a 2008 study by Sally, your subconscious can create any number of physical symptoms, including rashes, headaches, and stomach pains. Remember that your subconscious creates over 95% of your brain activity. So if your subconscious wants to be heard, it will find a way. 3. It senses the unseen. Perception is one of your conscious mind's biggest responsibilities. It senses and processes the world around you. That way, you can navigate and understand your environment. But what about your subconscious mind? A 2015 study by Watanabe and Haruno discovered something strange. Turns out, your subconscious mind plays a crucial role in both perception and processing. Conscious perception is slow and complex. Your conscious brain uses a narrow scope of attention to gather information from your environment. But your conscious brain misses a lot of important details. That's where the subconscious comes into play. Your subconscious quickly processes all the details your conscious missed. It's not always right. It's not always detailed. But your subconscious captures millions of stimuli you never would have noticed otherwise. 4. It's not entirely subconscious. Many people get confused by the term subconscious. According to a 2008 study by Barge and Marcella, the term has become synonymous with hidden or unintentional. But your subconscious isn't always hiding below the surface. Sometimes your subconscious influences and controls your conscious mind. Priming is a great example. Priming someone means using one stimulus to influence their response to another stimulus. Say, for example, you showed someone a sad picture before showing them a happy picture. The initial negative stimuli may affect the way your conscious mind reacts to the second positive stimulus. Countless studies, like a 2006 study by Stajkovich, Locke, and Blair, have shown just how powerful priming can be. By activating the subconscious mind, one stimulus or experience can change your opinions, emotions, and conscious decisions. 5. It hates abstract ideas. Your conscious brain loves to think in abstract terms. It relishes any opportunity to form new opinions or tackle hypothetical problems. But your subconscious is exactly the opposite. It hates abstract thinking. Many experts compare the subconscious mind to a computer because it doesn't understand anything abstract. It struggles with hypothetical questions. It can't speculate or form opinions. Even simple metaphors confuse your subconscious mind. If you want your subconscious to understand something, make it simple and concrete. 
Six, it doesn't understand time. Can you remember what you had for breakfast yesterday? Your conscious can. It's easy for your conscious mind to piece together recent memories, but your subconscious struggles with time altogether. Your conscious mind can think backwards and forwards, but your subconscious doesn't understand the past or the future. Has anyone ever told you to live in the moment? Well, your subconscious mind does exactly that. Has your subconscious ever changed your behavior? Have you experienced these subconscious mysteries in your daily life? Tell us about your experiences in the comment section below. Don't forget to click the like button and subscribe to Psych2Go for more psychology content. And as always, thanks for watching.